right here at Dr. Hayes's. And we now have a bionic horse. So took the sutures out and then um, kind of cleaned and debrided the area. And then she put a silver spray on here, which should, it's an aluminum spray, which should seal the wound and uh, make a scab under there. We still got some loose lips over here. And as we know, those sink ships. So, pokey, don't be sinking any ships. But just giving uh, y'all an update on her progress. So basically, this is leather. You can see it kind of puckering. And right here, it's right here. It's good. So here's good. You can feel it. But then leather. And then leather right here so here's a demarcation you can kind of see this hair is more fluffy and then this is kind of flat and dull so that's how you can tell and we're gonna come back in a few weeks when the flap starts peeling up and get it cut off because she will not let me touch her no shots no nothing she is does not like to be uh, poked or sprayed with anything so I'm gonna have to try to get them desensitized to horse spray and stuff like that. So, but just giving everybody an update. Dr. Hayes is a pretty nice, uh, real nice setup here. Very friendly up in uh, where the hell are we? Up north Texas, almost to the Oklahoma border, up to 69. But Dr. Katie Hayes, excellent vet. All right, thanks for watching. Leave a comment, like, and subscribe. It really does help me out. Thanks again. Pokey out.